Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for November the 27th of 2019, well, it is titled Hoag's Object, a nearly perfect ring galaxy. So what do we see here? Well, this is an example of what is called a ring galaxy and a very unusual type of galaxy in that it is quite different than the ordinary spirals or ellipticals that we're used to looking at. It has some distinct properties of the spiral galaxies in that it has a central region which is more of a yellowish to red color and outer regions that are blue. Now in a spiral galaxy we would see a connection between the two and spiral arms coming out from the center and then the spiral arms the very blue distinct signs of recent star formation that we would see. However, in this galaxy, there is a distinct gap between the two and it almost looks like there's two galaxies there. One galaxy at the center and then a gap and then a ring a galaxy around it. And in this case, no, they are one galaxy. But the reason for the gap is something that we really do not understand. And we see ring galaxies, not just this one, but there are others. And in fact, if you wonder how rare they can be, there's a second one in the image right here. And that is within the galaxy itself, well beyond this galaxy. But within the gap of the galaxy, off in the distance is another ring galaxy that is is visible. So what could cause these? Well, one thought would be that it could be through collisions, that a galaxy collision could splash another galaxy could splash through this galaxy and give you the sort of pattern you might see here as when a rock splashes into the water. But recent studies have said that it has not gathered any other galaxies to it within the last billion years. So it may be unlikely to be that and there may be other things involved that we don't yet completely understand. So astronomers study these ring galaxies as an unusual type of galaxy and try to be able to figure out what is going on with them. Now they're easy to see if we're looking at them face on as we are in the case of the two in this image. However, in many cases, we might not know whether a galaxy is a ring galaxy or not. They are flattened disk galaxies and you can imagine some of the other galaxies you see off to the right in this image that could also be ring galaxies but we would not be able to differentiate those between that and an ordinary spiral or a barred spiral galaxy because they would look essentially the same edge on it's only when we look them look at them face on that we see the differences in the structure. So it will be interesting to learn if this is just another type of uh, object related to the spiral galaxies, or if it is a completely new class of object with some different cause that forms this type of structure. So that was our picture of the day for November the 27th of 2019. It was titled Hoag's Object, a nearly perfect ring galaxy. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture. So until then, have a great day, everyone, and I will see you in class.